Yeah, Patrick, the union does not want a blanket shutdown. Instead, they only want certain departments to be closed and they want better protective equipment for the employees there. We got an email from the union tonight with a list of requests. Here's some of those. The union wants sanitizing, deep cleaning and fogging. It also wants mandatory face masks for all employees and face shields attached to helmets as well as plexiglass dividers. The union also wants a premium pay of $2 an hour every day for employees working during the pandemic. The Cudahy closure is linked to the shutdown of Smithfield's plant in South Dakota, where 400 employees contracted the virus. South Dakota's governor tweeted the CDC was coming to town there today while that plant is shut down indefinitely. According to Smithfield's statement, that has a direct effect on production at other plants, including the facility here in Cudahy. Derek, did the company say what will happen after the two-week shutdown? The company did not, Patrick, but the union says the shutdown, uh, that two week blanket shutdown does not ensure they won't be back in the same place they were before the shutdown. That's why the union is making those specific requests. And either way, Patrick, though, the employees during this two week period will still get their paychecks.